Hi there! In this video, we are going to start to dissect the exam topics for this certification. And the first one on our list is the UAP App Studio. We're going to specifically talk about the UI automation activities. What is the modern experience and what is the classic experience? Because for this exam, you have to understand the classic design experience for this UI activities. But it's extremely hard to understand that without understanding the modern design experience. And that is what we are going to do right now. Let's jump to the official documentation and then take a look on that. In this page, you have the documentation about the modern design experience. But what I want to bring your attention to is to the difference between them. And I will scroll down to this table here, but I have the list of activities in one, in the modern activities, and also the classic activities. And let's take a look at the click activity, for example. In the classic, you have four activities. Click, double click, click image, and double click image. Whereas on the modern activities, you have only one, only click, and you can do everything with this activity just by enabling different properties inside of the activity. Let's jump to my web app studio and I can show you what I mean by that. First, I want to show you how to enable or disable the modern experience. You have to go to the project settings. And this option here, modern design experience. If you have this option enabled, that means this project and the future projects will be using the modern design experience. If you disable this, means that this project and the future projects will have the classic design experience. And if you have installed your UAP App Studio recently, it will be by default the, with the modern design experience. That's my case. I recently upgraded my UFF Studio and I have this by default. I will leave as modern experience right now and I will click OK. And I also want to show you how to enable your classic activities even if you have the modern experience. When you go to the activities page, this one right here, there is a filter icon you can click on that and then you can see here show classic let me just minimize this because when i click on this show classic a new list of activities pop up here and i have the classic activities for this project now that will not change future projects that will change only this project so let's test this now and i want to show you the click activity that we just saw on the documentation. And when I search for click, I have several options. Everything that says available first is the modern version of this activity. Whatever is classic is the classic version of, of the activity. So let's take a look on the modern first. It's slightly different, but you can see that there are options for single, double, up, down, left, right, middle, everything you have available in this single activity. If you use the classic one, it's slightly different and you don't have these options to double click or single click, up, down. You do have the left and right in a different way. When you select this option here, you can define if you want left, right or middle but other options are not available here. So that's the main difference between classic and modern. And this will apply for all these activities inside of this table here. So you have to understand what it can do with the classic design experience and also with the modern design experience. Even though you are not asked to know the modern design experience in this exam, you have to understand in order to better perform during the exam. So that's about it and let's move on.